What is going on inside planet Saturn? All right, guys, gather around, for I have some incredible news for you. We're ready to enter the mysterious planet of Saturn. You know the huge gas giant drifting around in our solar system, second only in mass to the great Jupiter. But here's the thing, this cosmic miracle has scientists scratching their heads in bemusement. Saturn has them perplexed. The more scientists investigate this fascinating planet, the more its secret nature is revealed. We have precise information of the length of a day on heavenly bodies such as Venus, Mercury, and Mars. But what about Saturn? Oh no, that captivating rogue keeps its secrets hidden, even NASA's finest minds are baffled by the length of a day on Saturn. Can you believe it? And let's talk about the beautiful auroras that dance throughout Saturn's atmosphere. They're not your average aurora, they're more insane than a roller coaster ride. These vivid light displays hint at an unprecedented amount of energy hidden within the planet. Saturn appears to be daring us to question our assumptions about planetary evolution. Join me on this adventure to discover the planet's hidden mysteries. Hello and welcome to Z. Subscribe to the channel and follow us. Saturn is defying the rules. Imagine thinking you are in good health, only to find out you have a dangerous condition during a routine checkup. That's exactly what happened in 1997 when scientists launched the Cassini mission to examine Saturn. Cassini's data completely astonished scientists and challenged their understanding of Saturn. Cassini gave us the genuine wonders of Saturn in stunning detail. This enormous planet is dominated by strong storms and delicate gravity harmonies. It's like a chaotic and hypnotic dance taking place in outer space. But Cassini was not alone in his exploration of Saturn. It was carrying a special passenger, the Huygens probe from Europe. This probe was the first man-made item to ever settle on a world in our solar system's extreme reaches. It was like sowing a human seed on an alien land. Cassini ran out of fuel after a spectacular two decades in space, 13 of which were spent studying Saturn. However, before waving farewell, Cassini proceeded on a daring final mission to protect Saturn's moons that may have life-supporting conditions. It made a series of deep dives within the planet's icy rings, collecting crucial scientific data till the end. What Cassini discovered was astounding. Saturn's day was not what we expected, and its magnetic field and auroras were likewise far from predictable. Saturn appears to have its own personality, contradicting our understanding of the world. As a result, Saturn continues to be a mysterious and compelling planet, reminding us that there is still so much to explore and learn in this beautiful universe. The Hexagonal Storm One of the most enthralling mysteries revolves around a never-ending hexagonal storm at its North Pole. Since the American Voyager program discovered it in the 1980s, scientists have been mystified and intrigued by this strange vortex. The hexagonal storm has a diameter of 20,000 miles and is surrounded by bands of wind reaching speeds of up to 300 miles per hour. This storm is even more unusual because no other known planet or moon has a hurricane-like event. Many scientists have devoted their lives to unraveling this marvel. They may have discovered that the storm is caused by complex atmospheric circulation within Saturn. These fluxes might produce both big and tiny vortices, or cyclones, which would be surrounded by a larger horizontal jet stream around the planet's north pole. Surprisingly, this jet stream has a large number of storms. The hexagonal structure would result from the interaction of several smaller storms with the bigger system. The scientists participating in this study stress the phenomenon's uniqueness. On Earth, storms frequently assume the form of spirals or circles, but seldom hexagons. The size and persistence of Saturn's storm add to the enigma. How did such a massive system emerge, and why has it remained almost intact on this massive planet? How long is a day on Saturn? As previously stated, the length of a day on Saturn is an intriguing mystery. 
Scientists have invented sophisticated methods for determining the length of a day on other planets, but none of them appear to work on Saturn. Consider heating up a mug of milk in the microwave. You notice a logo on the side of the mug as it turns within. You can determine the rotation rate of the mug by timing how long it takes for the logo to return to the same location. However, if the cup is pure white with no distinctive features, the rotation speed is unknown. When examining planets, the similar problem arises. If you have a strong telescope, you might be able to detect moving characteristics on the planet's surface. When these features align again, you may compute the planet's rotation period by viewing them many times. Unfortunately, because Saturn's surface is cloaked in heavy clouds, this technique cannot be used. Even Saturn's famed rings cannot provide an answer. While the rings appear to rotate, they most likely do so at a different rate than the globe. This is comparable to what happens with moons in our solar system. As a result, the rotation of the rings cannot be utilized to calculate Saturn's day length. As scientists continue to investigate this mystery, they are looking at novel approaches to uncover the secrets of Saturn's rotation. Further research into the planet's atmospheric patterns, gravitational forces, and magnetic fields could hold the key to understanding its enigmatic day duration. A Strange Magnetic Field the study of electromagnetic field fluctuations on a gaseous planet may be the most successful method of determining its period. The most successful method for determining the period of gaseous planets is to study their electromagnetic field changes. The magnetic fields of these planets are formed by the dynamo effect, which is caused by the flow of molten metals in their cores. These metals spin and move when the Earth rotates, generating currents that generate magnetic fields. However, for the dynamo effect to work correctly, the planet's magnetic field must be somewhat offset from its axis of rotation. Scientists discovered something unexpected while monitoring Saturn. Saturn's rotation and magnetic field axes are nearly perfectly matched, with an accuracy of less than 0.1 degree. As a result, the dynamo effect is unlikely to be to blame for Saturn's magnetic field. This discovery calls into question our present understanding of magnetic field generation because scientists are unaware of any other mechanism capable of producing such a strong magnetic field. The riddle of Saturn's magnetic field has yet to be solved. A Fascinating Radiation Pattern the analysis of radiation is one last way that scientists can employ to determine the length of a day on Saturn. Radio waves are constantly rising and falling as a result of interactions between particles in Saturn's atmosphere and its magnetic field. When measured with our greatest telescopes, these radio waves appear to suggest an 11-hour rotation period as they rise and fall with this time. Higher amounts of radiation would arrive every 11 hours or so, and this is the best estimate experts could come up with thus far. Cassini, on the other hand, arrived to ruin this fairy tale once more. The spacecraft discovered that the length of this interval was changing. It shifted by 1% during the course of a year. It is not uncommon for the rotation period of a planet to shift throughout time. For example, the days on Earth are getting longer as a result of the Earth's rotation friction decreasing down. However, it takes a long time to see noticeable variations in the duration of the day. The large changes detected on Saturn are almost unbelievable, as there is no mechanism that may explain this occurrence until another strange factor is accounted for, the enormous quantity of energy stored within this planet. Saturn is quite hot. Saturn is an extremely hot planet, far hotter than it should be. It emits twice as much energy as it absorbs from the sun, according to scientists. This suggests that a lot of energy is coming from somewhere else. The question is, from where is it coming? One such solution can be found in Saturn's winds. When the cold and warm regions of Saturn's atmosphere collide, extremely rapid winds result. These winds could transport charged ions around the Earth, resulting in electrical currents. These currents may be produced at a constant pace or may vary somewhat during the day. 
This could explain why Saturn's rotation period, or the amount of time it takes to rotate around, varies. Not only that, but these electrical currents may be responsible for Saturn's magnetic field exactly aligning with its rotation axis. It's as though the winds and currents are collaborating to generate all of the energy that Saturn emits. As a result, the mystery of Saturn's extreme heat may be addressed by its winds. These winds generate electrical currents, which provide extra energy and may explain why Saturn's magnetic field is aligned with its rotation. It's incredible how something as simple as winds can have such a significant impact on a planet's behavior in space. While scientists investigate numerous theories, it is critical to understand that exact certainty remains elusive. The beauty, though, is not in the definite solutions, but in the pursuit of fresh and unexpected discoveries. Curiosity is the beating heart of scientific discovery. It is the motivation that motivates us to ask questions, seek knowledge, and explore our understanding's limitations. Dare to question, and the wonders of the universe will unravel before your eyes, my friend. Alright everyone, this video has come to an end. Thank you for tuning in. What are your thoughts about it? Let us know in the comments section below, and I'll see you on the channel again soon.